Hello beautiful friends. I just wanted to make a video to share with you a beautiful offering that's been going on uh, more or less since the summer. Uh, we took a little break and got back into it in early October and it is a weekday meditation club that takes place in the mornings. It's live online group meditation, mostly guided, Monday to Friday. And this is my warm invitation to you to come join us if this so appeals to you. The power of meditation is infinitely greater than we can imagine. What it does to your life is something that money alone cannot do. It's something that nothing in the material world can give you. And yet it's what we chase. It's what we think money will give us. It's what we think the status will give us. It's, it's essentially peace that it gives us, but not just peace. It changes the game of how we feel on our journey. It connects us and anchors us into this divine presence, into this love. And that's what we're pretty much seeking through the material world continuously, through another, through the attainment of some good or some valuable jewel. And of course, they're beautiful, valuable jewels. People are amazing. We love all of this. But if we're not in a place of depth, of space, of ease, we're not actually able to enjoy it. And what happens is we keep chasing for something else, for something else. Maybe this will give it to me. Maybe that will give it to me. But the truth being told is until we can give it to ourselves and sit in the space of our divine being, we are not this body and we are not even this mind. We are an infinite being of consciousness. And whereas I wouldn't even try and hold a philosophical debate on who I am and who you are, I can tell you that through practical experience of touching this inner space, the I am presence, I know I am. And through feeling this feeling, I am, everything in my life flows with ease, with peace, with joy and with a lot more love. Yes. And I am aware that most of us now know meditation is essential. Like you look at anyone who's achieving great successes in their lives or enjoys great peace, great health, has had some massive turnaround in their journey. And there will always be a common thread of meditation. It can be when one is walking, when one is working, when one is praying, when one is sitting silently, when one is chanting, singing, dancing, knitting, crocheting. See, there's no, there's no lack of ways of entering into the state, but entering into the state we must do to have a more enjoyable life, a deeper experience, greater peace. And what I'm making this post for is to let you know that there is an online meditation club that you're welcome to join. And it's currently free. I don't know how long it'll be free, but if it does go to subscription, it will be very minimal. But for now it's free and it's been free for months and it will continue to be free for months. It's Monday to Friday, online via Zoom usually, and takes place, used to be at 6.30 a.m. But in winter we've moved it forward and for the Christmas weeks and New Year's weeks, we've moved it to 8 a.m. So very accessible. It takes about 35 minutes and it just connects us and anchors us in, into the heart, into the space, into the I am presence, into light, into love. And from here, everything flows in our day much more smoothly. Our calm minds enable us to be fully present and to see the world and reality from a calmer perspective. How you start your day is essential that this receives some energy in order for your whole day to have greater peace. So whether that means sitting down, having you know a coffee and reading your journal, or it means jumping out of bed and getting going with everything in your life. Uh, the common thread is that we're all very busy, but starting a day in peace enables you to actually have more time in your day because you're looking at life from a more peaceful perspective. However, if you've meditated already and you're following this practice, you'll know that. And if you haven't, it's not about what I say, it's about what you experience. And that's why meditation is so huge in my life because the experience of it has led me to so much of a richer life, so much more stable, emotionally stable, 
um, presence, at ease, better connections, and just enjoying life more. Life is, you know, quite challenging. We're at a time of huge change on the planet, huge. And to anchor in each day into this divine presence, and we can anchor into it, and we do anchor into it in our meditation practice. Oh, all through your day, you can connect with this I am presence. All through your day, the source is within. All through your day, the guidance comes through, and it grows day on day, day on day. Ah, oh, yes more at ease with the space I breathe, I feel I am, you know, then I receive guidance rather than thinking, what do I do? What do I do? Yeah, it's a whole other approach, a whole other ballgame. It's a state of being and the state of being is you. We're not running away from us. We're sinking into who we truly are, into the, you know, the great holding space of the story and all the answers exist here. All we're looking for exists here. So this is my warm invite to you to come join us. I put a number of these also on SoundCloud. So you can go onto SoundCloud and have a look. If you go onto my bio, you will find a link to my website. It talks a little bit about the Rise and Shine Club, which is the name of this. And from there, you can go and have a listen to some of the meditations. Sometimes we meet guides, sometimes we'll pull body scans. Oh, they vary. They vary greatly and they really just come through. So I sit with guidance, see what comes and that's what unfolds. It's also a very supportive space. So if you would like to get into guiding meditations, also come along and sit with us for a while and let us know. And we'll invite you up into that space to hold. And you'd be so warmly welcome there too. So thank you for listening to this post. Thank you for giving yourself, you know, I am presence morning time. And if it's with us, if that appeals, I look forward, we look forward in the group to hearing from you. So blessings, my friends, blessings on this week of weeks, the end of 2020. <sighs> the whole world changes out there when we change in here. And this is one of the ways. Love to you. Have a beautiful day. Blessings.